Hey, what's going on everybody? Red Ronald Music here bringing you another video. Today we're on American Truck Simulator. I said a couple weeks ago in another episode that I wanted to pick up this game. So I went ahead and did. And the reason I went with American Truck Simulator over Euro Truck Simulator is literally just down to the price. And I know there's a little more stuff available for ETS, but we went with this one instead just because I got this for half the price of Euro Truck and I got the gold like addition so i have all the dlc and stuff plus i have a bunch of mods already installed most of them are graphics related and you'll see them as we go uh, i have like the real life logo stuff uh graphics and that's pretty much it i think and the gps mod so it looks a little different anyways we're gonna go ahead and take a job i think we're gonna take a quick job rather than use my truck just because I want to spawn with the trailer for the sake of time for this episode. Just because I've never filmed this before. I want to, I don't know how it's going to go. A while ago, I was making like 20 grand, but that one's weird. You know what, we're going to go with the 15 just because it's a little less weight. It's going to be an easier drive. But yeah, I said I wanted to get back into more simulator games other than PC building simulator. So we're doing that. I also have Flight Simulator X now, or 10, I guess. I don't know. Flight Simulator, I have that. Plus, I have a couple of the games that I've been looking into. We're in the rain. That's no fun. That sucks. I still have to, like, get used to this game. I think we're good on that turn there. I'm pretty terrible at like navigating this trailer still. Like I'm not used to driving with a trailer at all. Uh, the gears are weird in these things too. Let me see our distance. We should be good as far as gas goes. Plus it's not our truck so we don't have to fill it up. I do own my own truck. We're not starting out from nowhere right now. I've been playing it a little bit. Just to like get a feel for it and stuff like that and get everything perfect to my liking. Um, let me get a little more volume. All right. This is weird. I feel like you're watching me like drive in real life. I feel like you're judging me. What I really need is VR, and I have some plans as to obtaining some VR. Hopefully around October, which should improve a lot of our games that we play. You know what? I'm going. Have fun. Screw yourself. This is running pretty well. Right now I think we're in 1080. I've been playing it in 4K on my new PC build. You can check out my last uh, PC building simulator or my Instagram for that if you aren't aware of that. It's running pretty nice though. Normally I play in a 4K, like I said. Everything's on max and high and ultra. Right now I think we're in 1080 because it downscales for my capture card. I just feel weird like navigating those turns like that. Because I never know where the trailer is going to end up. Hopefully this truck goes over 65. My own personal one's stuck at 65. I think I have to like upgrade it or it's broken or something. I don't know why it only does that. We're hitting the speed limit right now though. I also haven't figured out like the time scale on this game. It says we have a six hour drive, but it's really not gonna be six hours. Uh, I feel like every second is usually five seconds of real time. I just haven't like taken the time to convert that in my brain. This tanker truck's going real slow. I think we're gonna have to overtake him. I haven't tried the online on this game yet either. I have it installed because it's like a mod or something like that. But I haven't bothered to mess with it yet.
but yeah, like I was saying that one episode on PC Building Simulator, if you guys have any suggestions for more simulator games that I should get, let me know. Because I'm looking to get, like, into the sim game thing again. We haven't touched uh, Car Mechanic Simulator in a while. But uh, I don't know if I really want to go back to that either. Eventually we will, but... I had to, like, burnt myself out on there. And we need something other than PC Building Simulator. I do have another new game coming for Wednesday, though, so stay tuned for that and make sure you're... subscribed to the channel down there. This game's so weird, though. Well, at least the truck is weird. Because you don't know when you're maxing out of the gear. Because there's, like, no sign of it. And the truck is so low revving that you can't really tell the difference between 2 and, like, 2,000 RPM and 1,500. We're moving right now. I know we're not supposed to be in the left lane, but... We haven't gone over the speed limit yet. We just hit one mile per hour over, and that's fine. Eventually, we'll scoot back over. I just don't want to get stuck behind something too slow. I'm also nervous, because I haven't driven in the rain in this game yet. And I don't know if it actually, like, affects anything. Like, I don't know if our trailer is just gonna, like, slip out under us. I do enjoy this game though, and if you uh, haven't played it and you're here just because you follow my channel and you're seeing what's up, first of all, shout out to you for clicking on something new. But uh, it's a weird, it's a, it's a weird game. Like I understand why people would think it's a weird game, and it is. But you're pretty much just driving, and you're like, why don't you just do that in real life? But first of all, I don't have to pay for gas right now. Uh, <laughs> And it's just like a relaxing game. Like, I have music on that you can't hear. It's in my headphones, like, directly. And I'm just, I'm sailing over here. This game has an internet radio thing, like a PC builder. Uh, I don't think I could turn that on, though, because I don't know if it's real music or what. Or if it's, like, free. But well, this is a very streamable game, too, and I keep saying I want to get into live streaming, but now my PC actually handles it, so it's going to happen eventually. And I'm probably going to do that over on Twitch rather than YouTube, just because, I don't know, it's easier. Make sure you follow me on what is happening. I hate trucks. The gears are so... Finicky. I guess that guy's like going to jail or something because there's like a helicopter. He's got the K9 unit truck right there. It's weird too because New York has a law where you have to like be a lane over from the cops. People don't always do it, but it's like a law and you could technically like get in trouble for it. Like, so yeah, there's a cop on the side of the road right now. That Ford Explorer right there would be able to be, like, punished for being in that lane if there's a cop pulled over. So you have to, like, skip the lane. And I'm used to that in this game, and it's weird. Because I don't think we actually have to do it. It's weird with the reference points on this thing, too. I know once we get VR, though, this will be an awesome game to play. As well as Flight Simulator, hopefully that works with VR. I haven't even looked into that. I just picked that up because I felt like doing something. 
And if you guys want to see that, I can bring that on here. These windshield wipers aren't doing very well. Let's see if I can just put them on like that. There we go. That's what I want. I hate those, like, intermittent wipers or whatever you want to call them. I hate those things. Where they only go, like, a certain amount of times and it, like, depends on your speed and all that. I hate that. I just leave them on like this in my car when I drive. Otherwise, it's, like, distracting. Like, this is, like, a rhythm. If it just happens every once in a while, it drives me crazy. I don't know if it's like all the racing I do in games, but like driving is like a very rhythmic thing. You know, I just realized we're still in this left lane. Alright, after we get past this dump truck here, we're gonna move back over. Especially because we got an exit coming up. Hopefully we can even get there in time. No, we're gonna have to fall back. Scoot in there. Shifting is weird. I might just rock automatic. It's starting to drive me crazy. So we have technically three sets of gears. Like we have first through sixth, then seventh through twelve, and then thirteen through eighteen. And I have to shift so much. And I gotta like switch between the gearboxes to mid shift. It drives me crazy. I might just do automatic. I don't know what everybody else does online. I know they do make like an actual shifter that's for this game specifically that has like the setup properly. How are we doing? We got two we got almost five hundred miles of gas and we got two hundred miles to go. We're doing alright. We got an exit coming up. Now my biggest fear in this game, and I've had it happen to me a bunch of times, is getting stuck on the off ramp. Right now it's not gonna happen because we can just like roll all the way up. Though I am about to clip that guardrail back there. Let's scoot over here. We're gonna hit that sign. Don't own a truck. I don't care. I still gotta get used to all this. It's a little strange. Like, I'm pretty used to it, but what does this mean? We got the train coming, that's what it means. I was wondering why the lights were blinking and the things weren't down. Where's the train? Here he comes. Now I was talking to my friend and I was saying it would be pretty like awesome if somehow they combined this with like the train simulator games that are out there. And then, like, also a plane thing, like a flight simulator. So, like, if everybody you saw right now would be, like, an actual person, that would be awesome. Now, I don't know if there's a mod for this game where you can be a cop, but if you could, then that would be pretty cool. We're gonna let this guy go. I'm not gonna try to dive. Oh, never mind. He's got a red light. Mostly the looking around is my biggest issue, because I can't do it. Like, I have to have a button set just to reset my view, and then I gotta, like, move the thing around. It's a bunch of work. And I don't like using the mouse, because I always feel like it's never back to normal. That's why I need some VR. Now, I'm assuming that lane ends, or I guess our lane ends, or something. I don't know. What the hell's going on here? Why is everybody going, like, a mile an hour? To 65. I just try to, like, avoid shifting at all costs in this thing. Like, I like keeping the speed, otherwise it's annoying to get it back up. It takes so long to go from, like, 20 to 60. That's why I like doing these lighter missions. We almost had, I think we have, like, a 20-pound or 20,000-pound cargo. We almost had a 100,000-pounder at first, and I skipped that one, so... It almost was worse than this.
I don't know why everybody's going like extra slow though. I wonder if it actually is like affected by the rain. If people like chill out when it's raining. Is this an undercover cop? <laughs> What's with the antenna? He's in a Crown Vic with a big ass antenna on it. Come on, let us over. I'm trying to get over. This guy isn't passing or he's like not staying back either. We're on this man's ass. Like we can't. I can't even. I can barely see the car right now. Let's go ahead and scoot. I guess the right lane's turning into the passing lane today. And of course our lane ends as soon as I get here. Let's book it. I'm driving like an animal right now. That's why I haven't like jumped into the online yet, because I'm pretty sure you have to be like pretty official. Like you can't just do that. I mean you can if there's nobody around, I guess, but if you got other people near you and you try to dive like that, they get pissed. It's in the rules. I was reading the rules. Alright. This is taking a while to get here. I guess I am going to figure out how long the actual trip is. But, uh, I'll get back to you guys when something's either happening or once we're closer to the destination. Alright, guys. We're at a red light behind a bus right now and we're about 60 miles out from our destination. You can see it on our GPS there on the dash. Or around the bend. There's so many achievements for this game. Well, I guess it's all like progress that it's telling me now. I could care less about the progress. But uh, yeah, since I'm still new to this game, if you guys are like experienced in it and you know some mods or something like that, some good stuff, let me know. Hopefully, uh, you could like give me a link or something. I'll check it out. Or if you guys play this online or something and want to make a lobby, I don't know how the online really works still. Let me know about that as well. Is our lane end or is this a two lane and this bus is just going real slow? Here we go with this damn shifting. I have to like hold the right paddle in the clutch and then shift. Like all the way back down to what would be second because I'm skipping gears. So you don't really need to go through all of them, I don't like. And of course our lane ends. Get right in there. Now I have seen some car mods. Like people have like Ford Raptors and Mustangs and stuff. I don't really know how you get that. Uh, I've seen things on the Steam Workshop, but all I saw was like a Skoda, and that's about it. Well, I didn't really look that hard. I just got like a couple graphics mods to make it look a little nicer. And we have longer yellow lights. We have this GPS thing at the bottom. It actually is supposed to look like this, but I turned it off. We just have the bar. Uh, what else do I have? I have better headlights, so you can see them easier in a mirror, because they don't really spawn in. We have real brands. I don't know if we got, like, some brand going on right now, but most of the cars on the road should be a real car. Why do I feel like my headlights aren't on still? Can't tell. I think they're on right now. It's weird though, because none of the pedestrians use their lights in the rain. I feel like, I don't know if that's a law everywhere, but I'm pretty sure, like, it is. I can't tell if our little sleep icon at the bottom is blue or not, but that means we're getting tired if it is. It shouldn't be. I went to, I made my guy wake up around, like, around 11. Like, when we started this mission was when my guy, like, got up. Oh, it's done raining. Let's get rid of these wipers. That's a good end to an episode. In the sun? Hell yeah. There's 5 0. I do like this game a lot, though. It's just like relaxing. I don't know. I hate that I can't see the stupid little light icon. I don't even know if there is one. I know there's a high beams one, but I don't know if there's a light one. I hate these types of turns. I don't know if it's like correct to go in the other lane like that. Like I don't see how you could do it any other way. Once you start in the far lane. Our dashboard looks weird. I can't tell if it's a wood or if it's just like some graphics thing going on. It looks like that smoked wood stuff you could get in like a Mercedes. <laughs> Here 
There's where we're going. I think. No, we still got a couple miles to go. Oh, well, you know what? This might be. This is the place. It's just an extra long driveway. I think I'm gonna do like oh, the middle drop off thing. I'm not gonna have it do it itself, and I'm also not gonna do like some crazy like throw it in reverse dive parallel park move the thing. I'm not good like that. At least yet. I still gotta get good. That's a bump. Drop it down to... we're gonna need second, I think. This is a bizarre parking lot. I'm already nervous about this drop-off. Where is that? That's down the ramp. We'll hit it. We can pull that off. That's right there. Scoot on in. Got plenty of room on the right side. There we go, that's a drop off. Excellent. We did get in a little conflict with a car. It was my bad, but I guess we didn't get in trouble for that, so it's whatever. But uh, yeah, if you guys like seeing American Truck Simulator on the channel, let me know. And if you guys want to want to see me stream it, let me know as well. I'd be down. I love this game. If you guys have any other sim games you want to see on the channel, leave the name down below. If you have any mods you want to see on this game, let me know as well. There's too much let me knows. Thanks for watching, guys. See y'all next time. Peace.